Hello, and welcome to that 3D Printer Guy. Today, we're going to take a look at how to check your DAT file for propware. Alright, the first thing we're going to do is open up DJI Fly and disable Flight Data Sync. By disabling Flight Data Sync, we help preserve the DAT files. Otherwise, after your flight is synced with DJI servers, the DAT file is lost. Now, with an Android device, head to My Files, Internal Storage, Look for DJI folder, the GoV5 folder, Flight Record folder, and finally the DAT file folder. In here, we're going to scroll down and look for our most recent flight or the DAT file you're looking to examine. Now that we have located our DAT file, let's transfer it to our PC for the next step of the process. Now that we have located our DAT file, I have placed mine on the desktop. Now we're going to open a browser and head to datfile.net where we're going to download CSV view, which is going to help us examine our DAT file. I have downloaded it and placed it in the same folder with my DAT file, extracted to the same location, and installed it. After the CSV view installation has finished, the application will open. Navigate to the folder you have placed your DAT file in and open it. After the DAT file has been loaded, we can now select motor speeds. Here, we can see the RPM information of each individual motor. Here, examining my graph, you can see that both rear motors are showing signs of increased RPM. But if we look at the blue line, we can see that it is marginally increased over the right rear motor, indicating that, like many, the left rear motor seems to show signs first. Let us review a known bad DAT file that includes the motor speed error. These are provided to us by Graham Johnson. Here, we can see that the left rear motor has increased RPM over the right rear, but both motors indicate an increased RPM overall. A healthy Mavic Mini should look similar to Graham's second chart. You can see how close the RPM is across all motors simultaneously. When you look at my graph here, you can see that my props are showing signs of wear. With the help of this information, we are now able to evaluate the conditions of our Mini and see if they are flying optimally or if we are close to needing prop replacement. 